Well, there is a warm weather business that is loving all of this snow. Believe it or not, spring planting for farmers could begin in early April. After a couple of dry growing years, their fields could be getting a head start on spring planting. John Lortzen shows us why. 2022 for South Central and Southwest Minnesota was dry. There's been drought and dry weather. And when last year's fall harvest ended, farmers reported parched earth extending several feet below the surface. But in an odd way, winter is helping with that. In some parts of the state, including here in Southern Minnesota, this will likely go down as the second or third wettest winter on record. And that's significant because the spring planting season is only about a month and a half away. Here's how. Snowfall and snow cover early in the season prevented frost from taking over. So right now, we really don't have frost in that field. Um, water can percolate into that ground. To prove his point, agronomist Dave Farr is pounding a fence post into one of his fields near Lesseur, something he's rarely able to do in February. The hope is that when all this snow melts, much of it will seep into the field rather than the river. We'll see how much of this stays on the landscape and doesn't run off, but uh, right now we're counting on it. They're also counting on timely rains this spring, but with two feet of snow cover still on the ground in many places and frost depth almost non-existent, they're hoping dry fields are a thing of the past. This will help uh, at least at, you know, near the surface for germination and initial water to get the plants going. In Lesseur, John Lordson, WCCO 4 News. Far said during the growing season, crops like corn, soybeans, and alfalfa can draw more water from the soil than from precipitation.